be sure to go to flipsidegaming.com and use promo code 6 for 10% off on orders over $10. You can do the same at the Grizzly Gentleman for the same discount. They're both uh, fantastic deals and they help support the show. What is up, mercenaries? Theric 6, back with some more Stone Shard. So this is uh, Stone Shard Season 3, beta 0.6.0.4. <laughs> Uh, this is uh, the most recent update is the way forward update that adds a lot of new AI changes um, and makes dungeon it adds it adds a couple of uh, dungeon variations the dungeon generation is actually entirely different add some new enemy types etc etc and as I said season three is going to be geomancy oh, only the caravan is gone my legs, my legs crippled. We, we've all we've all seen this already, unless of course you're new to this series. It's fine. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna we're gonna pick with Jonah, stick with Jonah, uh, because we want the extra magic power, and she starts with Geo. Uh, no other character starts with Geo, so we can't really make use out of it. Is that so? Plus we're going Jonah. Interesting. So here's the deal. We're in. Yeah, yeah. You can't walk. I, I have to do you stuff for you. Whatever. It's fine. About local so yeah, um, things in this game. <laughs> Have gotten harder. <laughs> um, they may change things, but generally speaking, things have gotten harder. <laughs> so we're gonna go into geomancy. Now we still are going to need to uh, do damage to people. Um, let's see, rune of enfeeblement. This makes them more susceptible to dablage. What's fortitude again? Fortitude. Reduces duration bank of okay. Um, this gets for three turns each stack prolongs it by four turns. So if I if I do this, this will give me a stack of runic empowerment, and then this will be seven turns instead. So I think the plan essentially for this is to um, grab. Or put down a runic boulder, preferably hitting someone. Then stone armor and just beat them to death with something. If, uh, let's see, perception, range damage. Don't really want to do range damage. Hmm. It's, it's bonus range. I'm not, I'm not entirely sure, but for right now, we're gonna, we're gonna go this and this to hopefully help my survivability and one of the reasons that go ahead and do this um 17 crushing one arcane 16 i mean this is still more the most damage here so that's fine um the reason that i'm showing you the start is so that once again you know that i'm not cheesing it for for locations. Um, speaking of locations, these are pretty bad locations for me. Uh, the closest ones are these two. And they're not all that close. But as normal, Tower Esper is typically the first one you go to. But I've heard that you want to be level 2 or 3 or so. So first things first, I'm obviously going to go uh, steal from everyone. Do it work for me. And get people's, um, get people's mini quests. So go talk to you. Well, I'll talk to you in a second. All right, so he's he's not been taken, um, so that can be one of the first. It's worth like five bucks or something. Um, it, no, 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 it's it's a potential thing to have him go away, but it's kind of nice to have him here, uh, just as some additional additional trade fodder, essentially. Uh... I think technically this frees up the most space. Uh, cheese, cheese for everyone. So I would like my things to be like this. Thank you very much. Hmm. 
There we go. All right, we have everything from here. Then we go and sell it. And this is this is the same stuff we did uh, last time, and it's essentially the the kind of correct way to go about things here. Um, well, you need something, so I might as well get your task. Uh, stack with you how? What did I sell you? Keep listening. Blah blah blah. Do you have any work for me? Cool, cool deal. Goodbye. Okay, so for those of you who are new to Stone Shard, this is a um, it's an RPG that has roguelite elements such that um, when you start the game, the seed changes the map that you have, and whenever you go into a dungeon, the dungeon generation is random. You also have random encounters whenever you go through tiles and things like that. So it's like a long-form roguelite. Uh, what are you selling? I would like to yeet some things. Um, this is the exact thing that I have right now, right? Yeah, it's literally the exact same. Um, the rest of this goes to the woodman. I think this technically goes here, but... Alright, it was worth two, not five. It's fine. Um, Alright, so we'll do that. Then we will... Go over here, and I'm trying to think... Um, I, I think I bought a belt last time, but I'm probably not going to buy a belt this time. I'm going to check, I'm gonna check the uh, things, just like usual, but I'm going to go through these first. Um, what kind of goods are you looking for? Whatever, it's fine. Yeah, sell this nonsense. I'm sticking with staves, because that's what I know, for spells. Technically speaking, uh, Geo Power might want you to do something else, but this is just, this is just what I know. And we might have to change things if, uh, nonsense goes belly up or whatnot. So, let's see. I'll put this stuff back. I want it. Thank you very much. Um, I have nothing to enchant right now. And I'm here. I'm going to go up here first, then diagonal down. Then I'll probably go to this one, but I'm not sure. Yeah, so we're going to go straight up first. Am I going? Yes, okay. So, typically um, in Stone Shard, you're going to want to get a little bit of experience before you uh, before you head to your first dungeon, just because this game is difficult. You you need to plan your things carefully, as if like this were real life, and you're an actual adventurer who's going to die. Um, I do want to do this first. So I'm not going to be focusing on any weapons this time around. Okay, you see this boar. The boars have changed. They will fight you now. Um, so right now, it's it's like, bruh, I'm upset. You see it, it's, it's uh, snorting, I don't know. Uh, and it's doing that little foot thing. We're just gonna, we're gonna back away. But I will say, I think that, I think that the AI is a little fucky. Um, so I'm gonna shoot you. Then I'm going to switch. Then I'm going to mob you into that. Put this on. So I now have this on for seven total turns. And I, I got a decent buff here. Right? This only cost me two energy per turn, which is pretty nice. Um, and all my stuff is just better. Um, in fact, I think I'm going to... Oh, whoops. If I put one here, probably knock some into there. What's he at? 27? Yeah, sure. I did lose all of my stuff, but it's fine. We got some fatty meat, and my armor is about to explode. There we go. Did a cool little exploding animation. Boar only gives me 5 XP. Alright, I'm not going to be fighting the boars. I thought they would give me more. They do not. Um, is it worth it for me to just like go back and sell this? Yeah, probably not. So, I do need to restore my energy. There are also uh, some new items around, which we might see. Uh, there are acorns and something else whose name I've forgotten. I think pine codes have already been in the game, but I don't remember seeing them, so. Yeah. I have reloaded, right? Yeah. But yeah, Stone Shard is definitely a game, uh, if, you, if you're not familiar, that uh, you need to be careful with. You can die in this game very easily. Got some pine cones, which are currently just ingredients, I think. I don't know if I can cook them. 
So we were up, we up, we went up once. So we're here. So we just need to go up one more. But yes, apparently, um, the deer. Oh, something's going on over here. Okay, boar's not looking around. Boar killed a lot of people, and uh, boar, I'm gonna kill you. Q. You. I uh, I missed. Yeah, Q. Okay, now I switch, and now it dash. Oh, it doesn't dash yet. Um. So I want to be able to hit it into... whatever. Stun it, get some armor, hit him. Um, alright, I'm, I'm in pain, but I should be alright for right now. Grab some of these. Got a little spear up here, get a pine cap. And the, the mushrooms and stuff are still very nice. Um, what's my pain at? 29? Eh, I'm not too worried about it. Yeah, I'm not too worried about anything right now. I do obviously need to be careful, because at any moment, I could just die. <laughs> um, and I'm going to keep saying that, because it, it really bears repeating. This game is is hard in the classical sense of like well generally speaking uh generally speaking you're gonna die because of your own hubris sometimes there might be some bs but generally speaking like i i'm i'm in this zone now and at least in the past there have been musical cues to tell me that this isn't a bandit camp as of right now this is probably a bandit camp so i need to relax for a second get my pain threshold down so that I don't um, I guess I could do like uh, do one of those um, get my pain threshold down so that I don't take extra damage just triple check that I am locked and loaded and so now okay yeah so the deer deer have a little bit better uh, eyesight and they if, as soon as they see you they run Although this one does not seem to be running. Which is... I mean... Sure, whatever, it's fine. So here I am looking for... A camp. And I'm fairly certain I'm in the right... The right one. And I will admit, I don't know exactly how the camp tile generation goes. But it seems like they're typically on more of the perimeter of things. Go a horse tail, because I might as well. Okay, here's the camp. You can see it down here. So we are currently in an okay position. I want to take things kind of slow. Okay. So right now, I can shoot him from here. And you might be wondering why I'm using the crossbow. Crossbow, as of right now, is still pretty decent for um, for ranged damage that you aren't um, putting points into, skill points into. It's just kind of a decent way to help if you're generally a melee character. Okay, so here's one down here. I don't want to go up any further. Just wait until I can shoot him. Can I just do a little shooties? Uh, you don't have... No. Also, uh, AI will start to flee if they think they're in a bad spot. 37. Um. Yeah, sure. Get hit into a tree. Let me kill you. I destroy the boulder. Pick up some stuff. Switch back here. Reload. Because I still don't know how many people are, are in this camp. New camp? New location discovered. Camp. So I believe this is new. I don't think this uh, this was there last time. Hmm. I don't see anyone else in the camp, which is interesting.
Okay. Okay, so it looks like pine cones don't get cooked yet. So yeah, so right now these pine cones, they do nothing. Get out of my inventory. Uh, I mean, this all looks like trash. But these are part of my first bonus quest for... I, I didn't actually talk to him. I'm, I feel dumb. Um, but for the blacksmith, those are my first uh, bonus quest thing. I feel like there should be more dudes. Got the dragon fruit, that's cool. I can't cook that now. Okay, nothing in there. Uh, I mean, there's no one here. So let's go ahead and save. Now, the way you save in Stone Shard is by sleeping. That's the only way you can save. <laughs> Doesn't matter how long you uh, you sleep for. Doesn't matter where you sleep. Sleeping is the only way to save. Now, some people think that that's um, too messed up. Sleep often, then. <laughs> uh, all right. So now we want to go diagonal down. Now remember, we, we shouldn't uh, we shouldn't get too cocky. And yes, I I specifically said it with uh with an L in there. Cocky. <laughs> Macaulay Culkin. Um, man, you. Darn thing. Uh, we, we, we don't want to get too cocky. Because, uh, you know, we, we like, we don't want to just... We could theoretically, like, scroll all the way down here and uh, and press a tile and we'll we'll start auto-pathing. But, we might run into a bear that uh, tackles us. And bears ain't nothing to with. Fox, I'm not worried about you. Don't know what that sound was, though. I'm glad that the fox just don't scream out of nowhere. Okay. You can get shot. Reload. Ooh. Okay. I think this is new battle music, but I'm not sure. Okay, so he's running away. He's running away as well. I killed him instead. Yikes. Um, uh, let's see. Where's my food at? Oh, yeah, I need to eat. Let's have a block of cheese. And a mushroom. This up here. These down here. No. Alright, take this, take this. Now, there was a man's who was starting something, and then he ran away like a coward. Oh, and he died. Oh, that's why he died. Um, wow, the wolves look like an angry dude. I'm still gonna try and fight you. Possibly a mistake. Uh, I think I want to switch now. Pass. Dash. Geo. Activate. Hit ya. Destroy. Jesus Christ. Um, I, mean, I think they're the same, aren't they? 50. The thing is, these these aren't going to get me, like, anything. So I actually think I can eat these. I do think the wolf, the boar pelt's probably... I do think the boar pelt is probably better. Oh, the, these wolves have been killing a bunch of people. Load. Cannot shoot him. And now shoot him. Yeah, fuck you. Interesting, retreating already. Oh, probably because I, I got him, gave him a head injury. Coward. 
Come back here. Roasted. So I am close ish. I, I don't need those. They're not going to be worth much. Alright, yeah, so these wolves, these wolves kind of went uh, buck wild on people. Cool. So we're still doing alright. Um, What the heck is this? Pain resistance, healing efficiency, bleed resistance? Ooh, cool. New flower. Um, I, So it's very good that there were only two wolves there and they were pretty spaced out. I also do like the fact that you know, deer is already running, <laughs> running away for their life. Um, I do like the fact that um, the the enemies will like run away if things are getting super bad, because that makes sense, right? Like even if you're a, a brigand uh, or, or a brigand, I should say, um, if you see three of your allies just die to a single person, you're not gonna want to stay there. Oh, acorns! This sounds like alternate music. But I know that they did, like, change the music tracks a little bit, so. Boar. Okay, Boar, you can see... Okay, you, there, you're there. You're there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave you alone then. Alright? Unless I have to go back up that way. In which case, I will come back and kill you. Another boar spotted. You're over there. You don't seem to care about me. So, no, it just looks like another camp. Wolves. Um, I can try and get them to fight each other. Hey. All right, so now we go this way. Those two should meet in the middle. He's looking for mushrooms or something. By the way, let me know if this uh, the music is too loud. Listen to your board. I don't give up. There we go. He died of his injuries, and I got the, I got the. Uh, the benefit of it. Hey. I did reload though. Yeah. Hello. There's another wolf up here. Another wolf? Hello? No? Alright. I kill this guy myself then. I'm in home base now. You bleeding? We're not bleeding. He's going towards the direction of the wolf. No, I want to kill you. You are worth experience for me. There we go. Boar spotted. Boar does not notice me. We'll leave Boar alone. So, for right now, uh, I'm going to put some of this lower value stuff in here. Um, like, for example, I don't need these just yet. I also think I'm going to modify this. Speed this. Uh... 
Uh, shift? No, Alt. Acorns, Wolf Belt. Some penny buns up there, always nice to see. We got a barrel, we already opened up the chest. The barrel has essentially nothing in it, and let's cook some stuff. Alright, just the acorn. How's my hunger doing? Nine? Nine's fine. You can roast the acorns, which is really cool. And we're gonna go to sleep and save. Jonah got thirsty just as I did. So, at this point, we still haven't gotten up to level two yet. Um, we're here. I think I'm going to double back towards town so that I can sell my wolf pelts. I don't want to sell these two things yet. Um, but I do think I want to go back to town. this general direction. Bear. Bear, also, not happy with me. I'm leaving you alone, Bear. I'm backing the fuck up. Um, I will tussle with essentially anything in this game at this level, except for bears. Apparently, Moose will fight back now. Um, uh, d -d boars, as you can see, fight back now. Bison already had fought back, but... Okay, so here... I'm gonna go ahead and go down. I don't, yeah, I was... I just... I just checked, um... The recording time. It's like, how long have I actually been talking? Bear spotted. Bear. But, but where is the bear? I need to increase my perception. I don't know where the bear is. I would, I would really like the bear not to be upset with me. Okay, there you are. Hello, bear. I will leave you alone. I'm going down this way. I'm going down this... Please tell me it wasn't the bear. Oh, golf. Uh, what the fuck? Oh, fireflies! Hey, Bear, could you, like, please leave me the alone? I really didn't mean to. I really didn't mean to. Oh, fudge. Um, I really hope this thing won't follow me into town, because town. Why are you Why are you moving like this? Oh, fudge. Town. You cannot uh, use your weapons or your abilities. So I would very much like for this bear to leave me alone. Come on. Really. No, I'm outie. Alright. I wanted, I kind of wanted to see if they would kill each other, but whatever. Alright, so we're gonna go, we go into the hotel. The Hotel Motel Holiday Inn. Whew, goodness. I'm gonna talk to you. I'd like to stay here for the night. Two weeks, please. Farewell. Shoot. Okay. So we're gonna put these in here for now. We'll put this in here. We don't have anything we want to use with that yet. Uh, and then we'll go grab this apple. Then we go to sleep in game. 
until 8 a.m. And then we say thank you all, everyone, for, for showing up. And I'm going to record uh, episode probably two and three, maybe four even, in this one sitting, because gosh dang it, I love this game. Uh, anyway, I'd like to thank my lovely patrons, especially Fogwin, for continued support. If you'd like to join them and support the show, you'll find links in the description below. Do, of course, hope you've enjoyed this video. If you did, like, comment, subscribe. All that good stuff really does help out the show, especially since uh, this channel is not monetized, so these videos are make making me no money. I do it because I love it. Uh, yeah, peace out. Until next time, I'll be one and stuff and junk and thanks.